we're ready for this one. Philly cheese stand. Papa Texas style. Yeah. Welcome. Today is a Philly a cheese steak night. <laughs> That's what we go on, going on for you. Let's take a little gander here. So we got a hoagie buns. We got two onions. We got two bell peppers. We got our Philly steak, real thin slice steak. You can do like a ribeye and thin slice. It's just easier just to buy it at the store. We got some mayo with olive oil. We got some olive oil. We got some Uncle Steve Shake regular. Some onion powder and some W sauce. The only thing I'm missing out here is my three cheeses. And I'll bring those out towards the end. I don't want them out here in the heat. I don't want them to melt, you know. I'm going to get this chopped up. Then we'll come back and I'll show you it thrown on the grill how we cook Philly cheesesteak, Papa Texas style. Yeah. All right, at this point, I was just warming up. We're going to get some uh, olive oil on there. That's so. I'm going to throw down the vegetables. I had some Uncle Steve Shake regular. That's so. It'll come up to temp and start sizzling here in a little bit. Throwing a little bit of Worcestershire sauce, the W sauce. We're going to throw in a little bit of cheater garlic. Not too much. That should do it. All right, let's get the meat. So I've got two bundles of this meat. It's going to make a couple meals for us because that is a lot of meat. We'll season it here in just a little bit. If I season thin sliced meat, beef, right now, it'll dry up on me. So I don't, I don't want that to happen. So I, I leave the seasoning off for just a bit and let it get all juicy. And I'll see you in a bit. So there it's looking good, ain't it? Woo! Wrong side, Papa. Alright, gonna put this on there liberally. I'm gonna throw a little bit of onion powder in there. That's so, eh, why not? All right, I'm just I'm gonna let this go a little bit longer before I mix it up. Got a slow rolling. I'm gonna flip the meat one last time, and then we'll incorporate. Look at that goodness! Check the vegetables. We'll get that Uncle Steve shake on that side. A little bit of onion powder. A few more minutes and we're going to blend it and add the cheese. Alright, we're there now. Now it's time to incorporate. Let's switch hands. Might have a little too much meat. that out just a little bit like that. I'm going to get that provolone to melt on there. If you don't have a lid, you just put a top on it. We're going to go like that for now. Let that melt. We're almost done. Boy, look at that goodness right there. Fold that over. Over here, we're going to fold this side over. Blend it in, Papa. That one's still trying to melt. We're going to add some mozzarella cheese. A 
That's so. Some Parmesan. That's so. Let that melt in just a bit. Alright. I'm giving up. I'm hungry. That's some good eating right there. Good groceries. So at this point, uh, both my both my gases are connected. Uh, at this point, though, if if they're not connected, this is when you would turn this one off. And I'm gonna go in here and put my uh, buns down, toast them. That's what I'm doing now. I'm toasting my buns. All right. Let's see what we got. Let's do this one first. Woo! Toasty. That one didn't fare as well. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to use these tongs. Just pull that meat in like that. Uh, the leftover, we're going to have sandwiches again tomorrow night. Well, I didn't want that chunky right now. This looks pretty good, y'all. Smell fantastic. So much for that one. Here's what my dish turned out to be. Let's go take a bite. <laughs> well, what do you think? Look at that. Let's grab one and take a bite. Now that's a hunk of hunk of meat. <laughs> mm. That's really good. Now the only addition would be if I'd have added some kind of if I created some kind of sauce and had a sauce on there. Other than that, it's fantastic. Uncle Steve said was a winner on this one. Hope you enjoy my cooks. If you're learning something from it, leave me a thumbs up. Subscribe so you know when I put another video or show out there for you. This is Papa. Papa Texas. Papa's Kitchen. See ya.